Meet Zaxton, a Texas two-year-old with a lot of energy. His hobbies include running, watering the garden, and learning about spaceships. Eco Blaster! Zaxton was born with a condition called cleft hand, with only a thumb and pinky on his left hand. Because prosthetics were cost prohibitive, Zaxton's mother Kathy researched the internet and found a set of plans for an adult prosthetic hand. She asked her older son Christian to talk to his former robotics teacher about using the high school's 3D printer for Zaxton. So I said, hey guys, <laughs> you want a project? How about this? And they uh, said, oh, oh yeah, that sounds great, and that's where it started, the whole thing started. Three of Herb Wasson's students were already looking for a Skills USA competition entry, so they quickly agreed. Uh, every week for the first three months was almost every single day after school for an hour, an hour and a half to two hours. The students tailored the existing plans to a two-year-old boy. They took his measurements, used CAD software to tweak the design, and then printed a new hand. There will be days in which Lexi, James, and I were staring at the whiteboard for half an hour until one of, goes, one of us goes, Oh, I get it now. It, it's got to do this. And to get the hand to do this, the students have made several iterations, each to improve upon the last. It's so rewarding to see the look on his face when we hand him the newest prototype, and he plays with it for a little bit, and it's like, you just see his face light up. Zaxton's mother, Kathy, agrees. And with this hand, he's going to be able to get more out of life. He's going to be able to do things that he couldn't do before. The Leander team will compete at the National Skills USA competition in Kansas City in June. But they've already won over this little boy. Jill Craig, Associated Press. You got it. Okay.